All right, guys, Gemini, back with the video. And uh, in this video today, I'm going to be doing uh, just a little bit of a rant. And it's kind of funny how these two things tie together, YouTube and WWE. And uh, you ask yourself the same question with both. Like, where, and, and I'll start with YouTube, okay? Where is the fun uh, being in the YWC in uh, 2016 when you have 100 guys uploading the same fucking raw preview review and it's the same look on everyone's channel talking about the same goddamn thing where is the originality and creativity in this community where it's not financial based it's it's not there i mean yeah you have a few originals you have myself who creates original content, Wrestling Jesus. I mean, a few guys who create original fucking content every day, uh, two or three times a day with original shit. But you don't see any creativity in the YouTube wrestling community anymore. You just don't see it um, at all. And so that, that ties me into WWE. Where's the creativity on their show now? It, uh, I mean, that's, that's for me, it's the biggest thing right now going for wrestling is they went from being a fun show like where you had to see it because you knew some cool shit was going to go down um some surprises and stuff to to now it's like wrestling match after wrestling match whoopee fucking doo i mean you wonder why um the ratings are down so much it's because the show's not fun right now it's just it's just not man i mean it's just gone from the days of, um you knew something cool was going to happen with Stone Cold Steve Austin and Vince McMahon. You knew it was going to be fun because you had to hear what The Rock had to say. I mean, you knew something fun was going to happen uh, on the show. Uh, I just, I mean, you knew some bad guy was going to beat the shit out of some good guy at the end. And uh, it's just, it's lost so much fun. Uh, I'm going to be honest with you, I haven't watched Raw in five, six weeks. Um, WWE is doing a house show near me. I could easily go. I ain't fucking going. I'm gonna go see a bunch of boring matches. WWE is doing a pay-per-view close to me. Uh, no mercy. I'm not going. It's not fun. It's not fun right now. You know what's fun about going to No Mercy? Uh, eating the food and uh, drinking and uh, buying merchandise. That's what's fun about the WWE right now. It's the live event experience but not actually going and watching the show because they're not going to do a goddamn thing on the show. And that's kind of how I feel right now. It's like you almost go for the experience of going to a wrestling show, right? But you're not actually going for the wrestling show because the wrestling show is just a wrestling show with no fun shit happening around it. They used to do all kinds of cool surprises. Uh, it used to be fun. It used to be like, oh shit, I can't wait to see that match. I don't know one match on No Mercy tomorrow. I haven't watched Raw in five weeks. It's just not, it's not fun. And uh, YouTube right now, dealing with uh, <laughs> you guys on here sometimes is just ridiculous. Like, I think I uploaded like a baseball video or something and it was like four likes and eight dislikes because I uploaded a baseball video where I said like, nothing bad. I talked about an interest of mine, baseball, you know. Uh, it's like, uh, I, I'd leave YouTube for a couple a couple months right or whatever i don't do a good job on youtube and it's like fuck you gemini your your channel's uh dead you know we're not going to support you anymore even though we supposedly have your back what the fuck is fun about that when a guy goes through rough patches life and y'all leave does that sound like fun y'all should be ashamed of yourselves fucking bunch of jerks